Hi guys, welcome. Look at the date. This is the 1st of December. I discovered something and that's the archlinks.org website. So if you go there with Bray, for example, and uh, we were looking at PCs, laptops actually. And uh, if we go to archlinks.org, go to the download page. None of these guys are actually working at this point in time. So Rexpace, I would have thought that the first worldwide would be present. But what do you know? This one worked. I've got myself a torrent, well, then software, Cupid torrent or something else, transmission. And then you have yourself an ISO. So I can do one of the first guys, right? <laughs> Let's try and install Arch Linux. Let's use this template for the Arch of December the 1st. So if you get in, if you get an ISO, you can burn it on a USB. We use our mint stick, our little icon up here. But um, now it's in projects. It's all Arch Linux. It is any of these guys. You can learn from us and then do whatever you want to do because that's the freedom in Linux. And that's the one, that's the new guy. <coughs> and off we go, right? Doof. The first line, the other one is speech. And off we go. It's normally a black procedure. The black procedures have been explained. It's not for the faint of heart in the, in the sense that, well, first of all, this is where you're supposed to go. Wiki, installation guide, right? And again, go through it. That's what you're supposed to do. But there are tutorials online for on different websites, not just archlinksd.com, where we install Archlinux to start, Archway, Phase 1, Phase 1, old machines, new machines, choose, 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 all in ones, Arch install spices. I mean, this all covers how to be independent from Archlinux, right? How to install Arch. And yes, then it's up to you to figure out what you want. Packages, configuration, desktops. Here we are. I have to set my low keys. I mean, I have an Acerti keyboard. That's one of the things in the Arch Wiki that's explained there. How the installation guide that you need to have the, your proper uh, keys here that it should work. So when I type the first letters, it actually types what I have here. It's best to wait a little bit. Why? Uh, Pac-Man is initializing his, his keys and all that, so that's fine. And then I'm, no, probably not. I go to sudo, no, not needed. We are already sudo, and Pac-Man does not exist. So it's gonna be nano etc pacman.conf. Why? Finally they, nope, not finally, nothing, nothing finally. Default still no parallel downloads. I want to have 21 of them. That means that at any moment in time when it needs to download, it will get 21 downloads at the same time. The installation is so much faster then, right? So that's the first thing. Then Arch install advanced. If you want to set the parallel downloads, if you don't want to do this, what I just did here, etcpacman.com, if you don't want to do that, then you type advanced, then the 21 is available. Now it is of course available. The advantage, if we probably type it anyway, is that the 21 will also be on my future system, right? So here we are, locales, click, off we go. You see me do this, ah, wang, that is wrong, right? And sometimes you can't go back. I've learned that the hard way. So be Latin, you need to reboot them and uh, don't make the mistake, right? So this configuration, partitioning, use best effort, X4, back, disk encryption, no swap, no bootloader, whatever, host name, whatever, root password. Oh, user. My mistake, too quick, too fast, too furious. Let's see if we can get it out of it. Always interesting to see if people thought about that. Let's see if I can type something. A 
let's see. Can we delete? Is that? Oh yeah, cool. Kudos, guys. Kudos. Add the user again, right? When you mess up, you can actually figure it out. So desktop in this particular system, I always choose XFCE, but there are more choices, right? And this, these two guys will be probably put more alphabetically at the top somewhere. But XFC is often the one I choose. Graphics drivers is VMware. Greeter is SDM. Back audio. This was the initial last uh, kernel, last um, ISO, I mean. And as kernel, I keep everything. A lot of downloads. Here they are, right? 21. Asia, Brussels. Did I do something else? <laughs> Euro Brussels, okay. Install, yes. When you do this like 100 times a day, all right, you get quick at it. Why do I, why am I quick at it? Because there's something called Arco install. And Arco install is a project of ours, a personal project basically. Git.com.com, Eric Dubois, where I use the power of Arch install on an Arch Linux system. So this thing actually creates whatever I want to create. In this case, ChatWM. Right, there are a few videos out there about it. In a playlist. So these are the 21 parallel downloads. Let's see how fast this can be done. And if, of course, the Arch install script is now working, like I said, beginning of November, we could not use Arch install because of an issue of uh, sound. So if you did not install the sound, everything worked. Things like that happen, that's normal. Look at them go, right? That is what I call a fast download. And the point of it all is keep reading, keep, keep recognizing words. WPA, supplicant, look it up. Pamek AOR, Octopi, both GUIs or stay in the terminal, but figure out if only it is with one sentence, this package does that. That's all you need to know, how it works, so that is okay. Here is SDM. What is SDM? Arch Wiki Display Managers, right? Read the Arch Wikis and suddenly, at some point in time, over years, you say, I get it. I get Arch, I get my operating system, I get my system, I can fix it. And here we are, as at the end, we're all good. Arch Links is good to go, right? We have a full fledged operating system with um, some things that are working already, I guess. So the audio mixer, powerful control, that's this one, is working. And recognizes a few things on hard hardware metal uh, real metal you'll find more settings make the display a little bit bigger on a virtual machine like this I keep this configuration then basically it's um, up to you to make it better install more software this is the basic xfce setting but it's good to know that the arch linux iso is fine is healthy use it cheers should i would i need i ah, 
uh, with the shoot. We can add one thing. I really think it's important, right? I create myself a data folder. I go inside the data folder. I open a terminal. I say pseudo pacman minus s y y u. I get stuff in. Maybe I get also neofetch in to tell you that we are on. By the way, voila. And then we're gonna git clone things. Git not found. Pseudo pacman minus s git. And this is exactly what I do. And I can only give a tip. If you don't follow it, that's okay. But on my GitHub, Eric Dubois, can I make this bigger? Right, github.com, Eric Dubois, Article X Nemesis. Do read the readme. It's just not about Article X at all. Not anymore. No para, void. I mean, they're all there. Right mouse click and then zero that's it do you want chat wm of course i want chat wm please install it right or no and then i just walk away have my breakfast as you see it's morning and then um, i come back and arch links will be the way i need it to be i want it to be all right cheers <laughs>